storm show. Ay, it's a storm show. In the Simone tribute she did on ABC for the uh, the Juneteenth Soul of a Nation special. This performance went viral because a lot of people had a lot of stuff to say about it. And I'm going to be honest with you. Chloe Bailey killed that shit. This is one of the best performances I have seen in a, in a while. Between Chloe Bailey and Doja Cat, we're actually getting entertainers that know how to entertain. We're actually getting entertainers with stage presence, with moves. They can move their ass around and, 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 and not move around like they got a dump truck attached to their spine. They can actually give us something without bumping coochies with one another haphazardly. People tried to drag this girl online, and I'm not seeing why. She's covered up. She's in a leotard. Her mentor taught her well. The vocals were on point. She can sing. She can sing. Oh, gosh, she can sing. <laughs> Actually sing, and a lot of y'all can't. She can sing, dance, hold the mic, twist, and I'm feeling good, 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 good. She can ride the beats. Chloe, Chloe, please teach some of these rappers how to ride the beat, 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 beat like you did. Feeling good, 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 good. She rolled the beat. Did y'all see? Did y'all see when she turned? She, she, she hit that shit. Boom, 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 boom. Did y'all see her? She on beat. Boom, 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 on. Boom, 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 on beat. 20 years old, know how to ride the beat. Can't even get rappers nowadays to stay on it. Music today is trash. That's why, that's why I'm so impressed with the shit. Anyway, a lot of y'all feel like Chloe's about to be the next Beyonce. I don't want to call her the next Beyonce. I do believe Beyonce is training her. I do believe that Chloe is up next. Chloe is going to be the it girl. I'm interested to see how long before, you know, they make her change her, her locks and change her look. I'm, 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 I'm watching to see how long she stays actually looking like a black woman. However, you can't deny her talent. She got the skills, she got the moves, she got all that. Hallie is the actress. Hallie is, is, is doing her Disney thing. Chloe is the singer and it in the performer. And it just is what it is. And when you watch Chloe and Hallie together, you, you see who's really carrying and, 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 you know, who's not? And that's okay. So a lot of people felt like the dancing was disrespectful to Nina, but Nina was sex positive. Nina was very open with her sexuality. Nina did photo shoots with her vagina out. Nina Simone was very open with her body and used to dance. I'm trying to figure out. Y'all didn't do a simple YouTube search for y'all trying to drag Chloe. Well, y'all just looking for any reason to drag this girl because really y'all haters because she looked good. She sounded good. She performed good and she did it better than your fave. And it just is what it is. You got to give her props. Now, Nina Simone granddaughter came forward and said Nina Simone would have approved of this. She would have loved this. And as far as I'm concerned, that's really all that matters. Nina Simone's granddaughter also said that the family no longer controls the estate. And said that Kamala Harris bullied the daughter of Nina Simone out of the estate. I'm trying to figure out where Kamala Harris had to do. That. I'm going to do some more research on that. Because that needs a whole video by itself. Because I'm like... What she got to do with this? But what we heard in the streets is that the daughter of Nina Simone, you know, was not following the rules that was set in the estate. But we gon' we gon' dig deeper. That's a whole nother video. All right. But I'm I'm just telling you what the, what the streets was saying. But nonetheless, if the family approve of it, she did a damn good job. She did a damn good tribute. I just almost think y'all not used to seeing talent anymore and y'all don't know got questions talking to one of the world's top 10 psychics ought to help dr linda salvin is amazing with an uncanny ability to clarify your issues and bring you quick and accurate answers and predictions from the white house to the homeless dr linda has helped thousands over more than two decades on her national radio show by phone in person when you need answers dr linda lights the way Book time with this gifted healer and clairvoyant now. Visit lindasalvin.com or call 
Call 888-509-1077. And you can bring Dr. Linda's metaphysical healing home with her spirit-filled candles, Wicks of Wisdom, where pure essential oils and elements are powerfully released through her proprietary rituals to assist you in love, legal, career, finances, health, and more. Wicks of Wisdom work. See them and order yours at lindasalvin.com. Always fun and accurate, Dr. Linda's visions bring you solutions. Call 888-509-1077 or visit lindasalvin.com. Get, uh, it's Storm Show. Ay, it's Storm Show.